Hi. Hi, I'm Michelle. I'm Alicia. And welcome, welcome to, to another, another video. video. So today we are going to do TikTok viral hacks, air fryer recipes. Ooh, sounds like fun. Yeah. So um, we are going to do grilled cheese sandwiches. Yummy. Uh, pizza bagels. Ooh, one of my favorites. <laughs> and um, pigs in a blanket. So, uh, yeah, they're going to be really yummy, and let's bust a move and get on into the kitchen. Ooh, I'm excited. Can't wait. <laughs> but really quickly, let us show you which um, TikTok we're going to do. Okay, here's the challenge that we are going to do, and these also are great for great snacks for game day, guys. Yep, so that's the one, and... Okay, so let's start with our ingredients. So I just got six cheese bagels, but you can do whatever kind you want. Um, I got pizza sauce, Newman's own, I prefer marinara organic. And then I did a four uh, state cheddar cheese. It's uh, um, four different kinds of sharp cheddar cheese and we have mozzarella and pepperoni. So I'm just gonna take my bagel, let's cut it in half. And then we're going to start with the pizza sauce. Okay, and then we are going to put them in the oven for six minutes at 350. Slide them in, and this is our new air fryer, guys. This is Big Baby 2. Our old air fryer, it blew up, Big Baby 1. Sadly, we don't know why the fan stopped working. We hardly used it, but it was beautiful. But this is brand new and state of the art, so this is our first time using this beauty, and we can see through these French doors here. So now we can watch it cook. So let's go. Okay, so as you can see, we are going to bake these at 6 minutes on 350, uh, and we're going to turn them at 3 minutes in. And I'm loving big baby too here, guys. She is uh, looking gorgeous. Love these new French, French doors. Yeah. 
which I probably already said, but we love it. Okay, so. Okay, let's pull them out at three minutes. We're going to turn them around and they are already looking delicious. And boy, they smell absolutely incredible. Yum. cheese and pepperoni. I'm excited to try this. It looks amazing in that four cheese. We use that bagel mm. in the back. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm. Look at the, the, the peach is stretched. Mmm. <laughs> oh wow. That is really, really good. Tastes just like um like like Chicago deep dish pizza. And it's um the pizza sauce is really, it's perfect tomato sauce, it's creamy, it's light, it's cheesy. The bagel is crispy and crunchy and so the softness and the crunchy together and all the flavors. Mm. What do you rate this, Michelle? Um, I have a 1 to 10. I am not going to lie, guys. This is a 10. I'm Thumbs gonna... up. What about you, Alicia? I'd say a 10 and a half. All right. It doesn't get much better than that. Mm -mm. I highly recommend this recipe, guys. Mm. And it's so easy to make. Okay guys, so on to air fryer recipe number two. Grilled cheese sandwiches and the pizza bagels were absolutely delicious. So let's get on with it and get in the kitchen and start making those fabulous grilled cheese sandwiches. Okay, so I am just using this sourdough. I like the San Luis Obispo sourdough. You can use whatever kind of bread that you like. And then I'm just taking butter and I'm going to butter the bread just like that and then we are going to get ready to put it on our I'm going to just place it on my air fryer pan I'm going to actually I'm going to do a little bit of Munster cheese here I'm making a gourmet grilled cheese sandwich guys I'm using a four cheddar blend and Munster cheese and mozzarella cheese. You can use whatever you want. Some people like pepper jack cheese or Gouda cheese works. Um, you know, jack, whatever kind you want. But I prefer this, so I'm just gonna put down two slices of Munster cheese. Just like that, take off the napkin. Okay, and then I'm just going to put some mozzarella on here. So this is the one that we are going to copy, the mozzarella and the cheddar. And yeah, so let's, we're gonna put it in the air fryer for three to four minutes. Yeah. For baked perfection, grilled cheese air fried. Okay, let's slide those in there.
Golden Crunch. Let's see what we have here, guys. Woo-wee! Look at that. All oh, that golden deliciousness. Cheesy cheese and crispy golden perfection. Air fryer grilled cheese. Wow, let's give it a try. Okay, do you see that, guys? How golden brown it is. The it's cheese is oozy. incredible. The cheese. Give it a try. Mm. It's so golden and crispy and crunchy. Mm. Mm -hmm. But it came out crispy. Mm. Perfection. So crispy, so golden. Mm. Mm -hmm. It's incredible. And the blend of all the cheeses makes it extra creamy and flavorful. This is amazing. I'm going to give this one giveaway really shot. I'm going to give it a 10. I can't help it. 10. And you? Mmm. -hmm. Not going to. Not gonna lie, <laughs> it is a 10. <laughs> it is so good and so crispy. Check it out. Incredible recipe. And we'll tell you which one is our favorite when we're all done. <laughs> okay, guys, so we are on to air fryer recipe number three. Pigs in a blanket. So let's see how those come out. So far, everything has been so delicious. Let's go to the kitchen. Okay, so this is the air fryer recipe that we are going to be copycatting. Um, except we're not going to use any of those sesame seeds. I didn't have any, but I think it'll be just as good. Okay, so these are our hot dogs, these are our crescent rolls. We have this, 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 and that, and then this is how we do everything. Okay, so let's get ready to make our pigs in a blanket. So I just have you can use little smoky links, but I just got, they were out, so I just used regular hot dogs and cut them into pieces. Um, we have crescent rolls, and then we have an egg, which we're just gonna beat the egg here. For a little egg wash. Like so. And then we're gonna open the crescent rolls. And then we are going to put the hot dogs inside of the crescent rolls. So I'm just gonna unwrap them.
Okay, so we're just going to pop those into the air fryer. Okay, so I just popped those into the air fryer for about six minutes on 375. Oops, let me turn on the light. There we go, now we can see them. Okay, and then we'll just wait about six minutes and see what we have. Let's prepare our condiments, ketchup and mustard. Let's have a look at that. Okay, we made an extra big one here in case, you know, you have hungry guys in the family. We made an extra one or you can make little petite ones if you want. So, it's up to you. Okay, so we are on our third and final air fryer recipe. So, let's give these pigs in a blanket a try. We made the little tiny ones if you want or you can go ahead and do a great big one. You know, if you have some hungry men in your family or <laughs> girls. I'm going to give a big one a try. <laughs> Ketchup, a little mustard, a little combo there. I'm going to try the other end. Mm. A little mustard, a little ketchup. Mm -hmm. it's, uh, it's very soft and flaky. And yeah, it tastes really good. It tastes like a, it's a great a great pig's blanket. Mm -hmm. Very tasty little bites. Go ahead and give one of these little babies a try. I think it came out really well. <coughs> came out. Okay, sorry guys, oh. I choked on a little too much mustard. <laughs> <laughs> She's all right. I'm okay. Going back in. Okay. Um, yeah, so these are good. You, um, these make a good treat. I liked it. I think it's crunchy on the outside and soft on the inside. Thank you. Um, this, uh, I would probably rate a, another 10. But my favorite is... Very tasty little bite. Yeah. My favorite out of all three is going to be, uh, hands down, the bagel pepperoni... The pizza bagels. <laughs> yes, pepperoni pizza bagels. That's it. That's my favorite. So and I what give, was your favorite? Michelle? I give these a nine. Um, they are really good, but I give them a nine. And my favorite, I definitely love the pizza bagels. Those were insane. But I love the grilled cheese. Mm. I it's thought so it was absolutely delicious. It had so much gooey, gooey cheese that it was a gooey, gooey delicious treat <laughs> okay great well we had super fun making this video and um, if you guys like this video and you want us to do more air fryer recipes let us know in the comments down below if there is anything you'd like us to make um we, we hope have, you enjoyed this video yeah and we we have another air fryer recipe one coming up um that we already shot and it's going to be dessert so be sure you stay tuned for that one the uh, I think it's the viral um they are the oreos the oreos i think they're deep fried oreos um i think the cinnamon sugar donuts air fried twinkies mm -hmm. and the s'mores dip so that's going to be amazing yeah so thank you and be sure to like, like and subscribe, subscribe.